Hello, Tri Enthusiast. My name is James, and I've just realized what's wrong with this scenario. What is wrong with it? We've locked up the wrong character. <laughs> Ah, uh, let's send our summoner down. Yeah, we're logged in the wrong character. Be right back. There we go. Walter is a little bit more suitable than Edward. <laughs> Which Edward is from our last series. Today, we are going to be continuing with what we started yesterday. We started by building a nice little stadium over here. We've got this nice little stadium for Plantera. There's a life crystal down there, apparently. So we built all of this. We have our Plantera bulb. But we don't have the remaining life through that we need. We don't have the total shells. So today I'm going to try and do a little bit off camera. I I'm going to do some off camera stuff now. And then I will work on it with you guys at home. If I can't seem to get too much done before, um, essentially before I feel like I need to start recording. I will just have to cut in. We'll have to do it together. So I'm going to do a little bit on my own. And then if we can find out together, that'd be good. Yeah, we'll just see how today's episode actually pans out. I've got way too much junk in my inventory I don't really care about. Like this, Gladiator legs. Don't really need them. Right, I'm going to get working on that and uh, I'll cut back in with hopefully some cool stuff that I found. Maybe. Hopefully. So I'm currently doing mining while in 1080p, which my computer really doesn't handle very well. But uh, shout out to the ambulance people. I wanted to show off this really cool uh, two gem stone cave area. Kind of cool. I thought it was pretty awesome. All right, I gotta go back to the jungle now. But I just wanted to come and pillage it because it looked cool for Spelunker potion. Very cool indeed. Okay, so great news. Uh, we now have all of the life fruit that we need. All right, we're on a uh, four nine five. Let's add another one. Bam! We are done. So we have all of the life fruit that we need. It does go to 500, right? Not 600. Yeah, 600 with the, the life force, right. So we've got all of... Oh, my headphones have fallen off. We've got all of the life fruit that we need. We just need to find the total shells now, which are going to take some time. So, what do we do until then? Well, what I may propose is that I may end my recording session here today, in the sense of, like, it'll be done today. And then this episode will go out a day late, so it won't be daily. Because otherwise we're going to have to spend hours looking for the turtle shells because I've literally been fighting turtles for like a good hour and a half. Like, so I don't know. So I think that's probably what I'm going to do. So the next time you'll see me, it'll be a brand new day, a fresh new day, and we can start killing turtles and killing Plantera. So, see you tomorrow. Okay, I'm back. Brand new day. And uh, there's one thing I forgot to say yesterday. There is actually one thing that I need other than turtle shells. I'm just moving my microphone around there. I need... Light Discs, the tutorial series that I've been following with this series, like to try and make sure that I can actually do it. Really recommend Light Discs. I'm not sure exactly, they need four to make, and you need Souls of Light and Souls of Might. We have 30, so we'd be able to make, how many have we got? We've got, you need four bars, so we'd be able to make one, two, three. Be able to make three. Now that's a shame because we do need like five. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know if, uh, I don't know if we could do this without them. I, I feel like we can. I feel like we can do it without them, but it'd just be a little bit harder. So I'm going to try it without them, um, and we'll see what happens. But I still need to find all the turtle shells, sadly. So I'm going to go on a hunt today. I'm going to go try and find as many as I can. And then um, once we find them, we can start fighting this thing. Okay, everything is set. We have potions. We have our turtle shells. So we've got to do some crafting now. Going to make some important decisions. This is going to be our first attempt at this fight. I don't think I've done Plantera Expert Mode. I have done it, but I did it so long ago that I don't think it counts anymore. Oh, I'm very nervous for this fight. I'm very, very nervous. All right, we just need our Chlorophyte, which will be around here somewhere. There it is. Uh, we have our Turtle Shells, so we can just start crafting, right? Oh, do you actually have to make the bars? Let me just make sure that I've got the right... Uh, Crafting recipe for this thing. I don't want to. I don't want to mess this up. Right, where's my guide? My guide should be. Oh, he's over there. Guide, come back here. Right, which guide? Right, Brendan. Brendan, tell me all about turtle shells, buddy. Right, okay. Is the bars then? Okay. Ooh, very nervous for this. Very, very nervous. Sixty-one, not bad. All right, turtle armor. Turtle armor. Turtle armor. Turtle armor. Right, one set of turtle armor. Okay, which we now have 75 defense, but enemies are more likely to tag at us. Also, attackers take full damage. All right, okay, cool. All right, so we need to put that in some kind of chest. Uh, we need to put in that, that, and that. Put in this life fruit, why not? Wow, we actually had just enough. We only had seven bars to spare. 
Okay, so I've got my potions ready. We're just gonna get them in an order, an orderly fashion. Okay, so potions, potions, potions. Right, we've got Titan, Iron Skin, Regen, Swiftness, Wrath, Life Force. I want a Hunters. So it looks cool. Uh, where's my Night Owl? Got a Night Owl. And then, I think that's it. I think that's, um, yeah, that should do it. Right, okay. Very, very nervous for this. Because <laughs> I know it's going to be a scary fight. I'm going to take my headphones off as well so I can fully, fully, and move my microphone so I can fully, fully see what we're going to do. Wow. I hope I don't lose this one. I really hope I don't lose it, but then again... This is the hardest of the bosses in terms of like, it's a lot harder than all the mechanical bosses, so I should expect a difficulty curb. I should expect it. It's coming. Wow, already, yeah, wow, already got them more enemies spawning, I can tell already. Right, so let's come down to our arena. We need to clear out the arena and make sure it's all sealed off, because we do get a lot of enemies down here. Um, oh, and sorry for the echo today. It's a little bit more echoey than usual. I do apologize. All right. Okay, right. This area down here is always bombarded with stuff, so we're going to take all of it out. Always got people in it. Okay, let's take out all of this, and these guys, and right. One thing we have to do is sort out this area here, so we've got to turn off auto mine. The problem with this arena is that enemies spawn in it at the bottom, like they just spawn out of their own, like, choosing. So uh, that may be a problem because it's a little bit too big and wow, there are a lot of enemies down here. Yeah, that's pretty insane. Um, okay. So giving them no route to spawn in, does that stop them from spawning? Does that like, does that make it eligible for non-spawning enemies? It'd be cool if it did. Because as we come up, they spawn in, which is not really a good thing. Right, okay, we're going to grab some blocks from here. Just so we can seal everything off. Right, let's put some blocks over here. And let's put some blocks up here. We need to make sure that nothing can get in that we don't really want. The good thing about this arena is that Medusas don't spawn, which is good. Medusas don't like to spawn in, which is, uh, which is really good. Because they spawn into that bottom half. Right, okay. Gotta make sure that everything is sorted. Put up some torches. You know, make sure it's nice and bright for all of you at home. Lots of torches going on. Wow. Look at all of this. I'm very nervous. I don't know how this is going to go. I'm going to wipe my headphones back on because I want to hear this fight. Right. Enemies are always spawning in. We're just going to have to make sure we take them out during the fight. Okay, so I have a clear strategy for this. The strategy kind of goes as follows. For the first round, I'm going to be uh, just kind of looping it in a circle like this, making sure to use my shield and stuff. And then for the, four, uh, the final bit, I'm going to be doing the whole stadium like this. Like, really getting in a big circle. Oh, look, there's enemies already spawning. We can't really do anything about it, can we? Not really. There's cubes, there's one to spawn from anywhere, don't they? Oh my god, look at this. Already got lots of enemies up here. Let's make sure that it can't fire through. Right. Damn, there is way too much around. What, what can we do to stop this happening? Oh, I like this bizarre. Right. Okay, wait till we're at full health and then we'll do this. Let's heal up. Make sure that no enemies are spawning in. Let me check at the bottom. Have we got enemies? Nope, we're good. We got enemies at the top. Yep, lots of enemies. Once all the enemies start spawning around the area, then they'll stop spawning inside, I imagine. So once there's enough on the outside, we'll have a nice area to work with. Right, okay. We're at full health. I'm going to do this. Buff up. Okay. Alright, I'm very nervous. Oh, there you go. There she is. Okay, gotta be careful because she does fire spike balls. And we got to make sure we don't get hit by them. God, I absolutely suck at this fight in normal mode. Can you imagine how I'm going to do in expert mode? Hey, it is expected to die a lot during this fight though. Because it is, it is really hard. So it is expected to die. Like, you are expected to die. Ooh. Okay, doing alright so far. Not taking too much damage so far, but this is the early phase. The problem that happens is they've got to spawn a lot more tentacles than this. Alright, I'm happy with this Shadow Flame Knife so far. I'm not regretting it. 
over the um, over the uh, the light discs. Doing so well so far. Ooh, okay. Because once we have this one out of the way, things are going to be a lot easier. That's the thing. Because this this like this hard mode expert boss is actually pretty insane. It's also pretty scary. Right, okay, got to make sure my mouse is on point. Right. Alright, my aim is good. Right, okay, so full stadium now. Gotta make sure you keep in between the tentacles. Oh, not using my dodge. Alright, remember I can't tank this. Okay. Oh, gotta remember I can't tank this. That's the biggest thing. You have to remember I can't tank this. Okay, James, you're doing okay. You're doing okay. I haven't mastered the uh, the double swipe down the uh, the platform area yet. Okay. Ooh, this second form really is challenging. But this is all the stuff we're ever going to do it with. So um, so if I lose this one, uh, I've got to retry it again with the same setup. Right. Okay. What did we get that one down to? We got that one down to. Well, it doesn't show you its health because it's moved off the screen. Are you going to come back on the screen? No. Whew! That was a hard fight, man. That was a really hard fight. I think the thing that failed was there was, there was probably a few things. One was uh, my fear of losing. I really do feel like that had an effect on me. I feel like, because I thought I was going to lose, I kind of did. I had no real faith. Um, it was a very nerve-wracking fight. What we're going to do now is we're going to... Stop taking the rainbow torch. We're going to um, take some more potions and we're going to do it again, because why not? Alright, so I'm going to get all my potions ready and I'll be right back. Okay, we are back again. I have another plantera ball, but a way of getting to the fight. Now, this time, we're going to win, right? We're going to win one because I've seen how easy it is in that first half. I'm not scared of it. And, um, yeah, I feel like we can do it the second time. i got faith in us. The only... Oh, a moth. Don't they drop moth wings sometimes? Yeah, I believe I was going to make a video on this and could not get enough moth wings one time. Right, okay, so... Uh, we're going to be trying this out. I've got full health. We're going to click spawn. No, no, Medusa, Medusa, Medusa. Oh my god. Are you joking? Are you actually joking? Right, okay. Ooh, ooh. Got to make sure, buff up. Got to make sure we don't die on the way. Remember, if you go too far, she doesn't like it. Come on, don't despawn, don't despawn. We're just off up here, Plantera. Just off up. Plantera, Plantera, maybe we're just off up here. Right, okay. There we go. Here we are, back to our normal place. Didn't lose too much health at all. Like, it was uh, not... It wasn't too bad at all. Right, okay, we can do this. We have done this before. We can do this half. Easy. Right, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Because this half's not too bad at all. Just got to stay focused on the target. Got to be uh, cautious of health. We're not losing any health at the minute. Now, what do we have to remember for that second form, right? Use the shield, right? Given a Captain America speech here, right? What does Captain America do in a situation like Plantera? What does he do? He uses his shield. All right, we got to remember to use that. All right, thankfully these spike balls are staying nice and low for us, so we don't have to worry about them too much at all. All right, are we down to halfway yet? Oh, we're almost there. We're almost there. We're taking a little bit of damage this time. Just taking a little bit. We've got 30 damage there. Just taking a little bit, but it's not too much. It's nothing we have to uh, be scared of. Wow, okay, maybe taking a little bit too much damage this time around. Only because these uh, spike balls are not doing what they were supposed to. Maybe Plantera doesn't like me today, or I'm just dodging weirdly. Alright, okay, heal up. Alright, we're full health into this fight. We have got this. Alright, Captain America. What's he do? He uses his shield. He doesn't get caught in corners like that. Ah, oh, no. No. No, 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 no. Chances of winning this now? 0%. Uh, I'd say it's about 5%, really. And we died. Alright, we got him down to 1,400 health, though. Not bad, not bad. Whew. That is a hard fight, gentlemen. That's a very hard fight. I may have another crack at it tomorrow, but that's going to do it for today's episode. Today's episode, although it doesn't seem as long as some of the others, it has actually taken me 
a lot of hours. It took me it took me a lot of hours to find all the life fruit, and it took me a lot of hours to find the turtle shells. Like a lot, a lot of hours. So today's episode took a lot of time. So if you could please leave this video a like, that would be absolutely awesome. And if this is the first video you've seen of mine, make sure to click that subscribe button. By clicking that button, you'll be the first to see the latest episode as soon as they arrive. So have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.